So in case you are wondering which mobile to purchase and your budget is 10,000, then don't worry, you are at the right place. We have carefully curated a list of mobiles and in this video, I am going to talk about the top 5 mobiles under 10,000 which you can purchase. So with that being said, let's get started. So before proceeding further, if you haven't subscribed to our channel, please click that subscribe button and click the bell icon to get notified whenever a new video is uploaded. So the first mobile on the list is Redmi 4A, which comes around uh, 5,999, that is 6,000 rupees. And this Redmi 4A runs on Android 6.0.1 Marshmallow, and the smartphone has a 5-inch HD IPS LCD display on it, and it has a 13MP rear camera with a LED flash and a 5MP front-facing camera which captures beautiful images and the device is powered by a 1.4 gigahertz quad core snapdragon 425 processor and it has 2 gb inbuilt ram so it has a 16 gb of internal storage which can be further expanded via sd card and this model is available in 32 gb model also and the battery comes with a 3120 mAh lithium ion battery and the battery usage is also fair on this mobile so for a person with minimal usage and uh, low budget this mobile would be the best option available so the second option on the list is redmi 4 which comes for around 7000 rupees and this mobile runs on android 6.0.1 marshmallow the same as redmi 4a and the smartphone has a 5 inch full hd ips lcd display and it has a 13 mp rear camera with an led flash and a 5 mp front facing camera and the device is powered by 1.4 gigahertz octa core processor whereas redmi 4a is powered by a quad core processor this mobile is having an octa core processor with snapdragon 435 processor so whereas redmi 4a is sporting a 425 snapdragon processor but this device is sporting a snapdragon 435 processor and a 2 gb of ram and it has a 16 gb of inbuilt storage which can be further expanded via micro sd card up to 128 gb and it too has a fingerprint scanner it sports a curved display with corning gorilla glass protection which feels premium in hands and it comes with a 4100 mAh battery and the battery usage is also fair on this device when compared to the redmi 4a it has almost 1000 mAh extra battery on it so the overall the device is good for a medium usage person like those who don't play heavy games etc this mobile will be the best option who deserves a fingerprint scanner and corning gorilla glass protection you just need to pay 1000 rupees extra compared to redmi 4a and you will be getting this fingerprint sensor and a curved display and a corning gorilla glass protection on your device and also you need to think about this battery 1000 mAh extra battery available on this device so the third device on this list is lenovo k6 power which comes at around 8500 rupees and the lenovo k6 power has 5 inch full hd display with a 441 pixel density and it runs on marshmallow 6.0 and it sports a Snapdragon 430 SoC with an octa-core 1.4 GHz Cortex A53 CPU and it has a 3 GB RAM and 32 GB of storage space available and it can be expanded up to 128 GB with an external SD card and it has a 13 MP rear facing camera and with LED flash support and HDR also can be supported on this device and an 8 MP front facing camera and a 4000 mAh non-removable lithium polymer battery which powers the phone and this device performs well while performing gaming or some kind of multitasking so this device is suitable for a medium usage person who often plays games and does some kind of multitasking on the device so the fourth device on this list is this moto epo plus which comes at around 9999 that is 10000 rupees and this moto epo plus runs android 7.1 nougat and the smartphone has a 5.5 inch hd smudge resistant display that is, this device will not capture any fingerprints on this device, that is, no smudges can be seen on this device. It has a 13MP rear facing camera with an LED flash support and a 5MP front facing camera. The device is powered by a 1.3 GHz quad core MediaTek processor and a 3 GB RAM in it. And it has 32 GB internal storage, which can be further expanded via micro SD card up to 128 GB. And the battery on this device is humongous, that is, 5000 mAh lithium ion battery, which can run throughout a day. So this mobile is for the persons who use the mobile a lot but not heavy user like who won't install any heavy games and stuff like that. So overall the device can run throughout a day for an 
average user person. The fifth device is Redmi Note 4, which comes at around 10,000 rupees on Amazon. So Xiaomi Redmi Note 4 comes with a 2GB RAM and runs Android 7.0 Nougat. The smartphone has a 5.5 inch Full HD IPS display and it has a 13 MP rear -care facing camera with a dual tone LED flash and a 5 MP front facing camera. The device is powered by a 2GHz octa-core Snapdragon 625 processor and a 2GB RAM and it has a 32GB internal storage which can further be expanded via micro SD card. So the battery on this device is 4100mAh which is pretty good to run throughout a day. So guys, these are the list of devices which can be good for you for a budget of 10,000 rupees. So based on your usage, you can choose whichever mobile you want. So guys, that's all from this video. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you like this video, please click the like button and share with your friends. And please don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more technology related information and day to day updates. Until then, this is Bablo signing off. Bye bye.